LNG regasification is the process of converting liquefied natural gas, LNG, back into its gaseous form for use as a fuel or for distribution through a natural gas pipeline system. LNG is a natural gas that has been cooled to a very low temperature, minus 160 degrees Celsius or minus 256 degrees Fahrenheit to liquefy it for easier storage and transportation. The regasification process takes place at a receiving terminal or facility, typically located near coastal areas or where natural gas pipelines are accessible. The terminal consists of various components and equipment designed to handle the LNG and convert it back into its gaseous state. Here is a step-by-step -step explanation of the LNG regasification process. LNG Storage The LNG is received and stored in large cryogenic tanks at the terminal. These tanks are heavily insulated to maintain the extremely low temperature of the LNG. LNG Unloading The LNG is unloaded from the carrier vessel using specialized cryogenic transfer systems. The LNG is pumped from the carrier's storage tanks to the terminal's storage tanks through insulated pipelines. LNG Vaporization The LNG is fed from the storage tanks to regasification units, which are typically heat exchangers. In these units, the LNG is warmed by exchanging heat with a heat transfer medium, such as seawater or warm water from a power plant. As the LNG passes through the heat exchangers, it absorbs heat and gradually warms up, causing it to transition from a liquid to a gaseous state. Pressure Adjustment Once the LNG is vaporized, the resulting natural gas may need to be compressed or have its pressure adjusted to match the requirements of the local pipeline system or the end-use applications. This is typically done using compression equipment, such as compressors or pressure regulation systems. Impurity Removal Prior to being sent into the pipeline system, the regasified natural gas may undergo a purification process to remove any impurities or contaminants, such as water, heavy hydrocarbons, sulfur compounds, or particulate matter. This ensures that the gas meets the required quality standards. Distribution the regasified natural gas is then typically sent into the local natural gas pipeline system for distribution to end users, such as residential, commercial, or industrial customers. It can also be used as fuel for power generation or other industrial processes. LNG regasification plays a crucial role in enabling the transportation and utilization of natural gas from distant sources, as LNG can be efficiently transported in its liquid form. It provides flexibility in the delivery of natural gas and helps meet the demand for clean and reliable energy in various regions around the world.